Okay, so um, so today was very productive. Today was very productive. I managed to um, apply the techniques that Derek Hopper and, um, told me about. I wrote an article um, relating to the to the people who I was going to contact. And what I did was I told I found an article from a lady that showed some scientific studies, and then I told her that I was going to quote her my article. And I sent her the message, and she retweeted it, and and it was special because you know she actually linked it, you know, and I sent a whole bunch of messages to people, telling them, you know, people who might be interested in that article, and so I should expect to hear back from them. Um, but above all, though, I, the point is that I applied what he recommended, you know, <clears throat> and that's the main thing. And yeah, man, like, today I, uh, I gotta say, I was very productive, I was more focused into things I was gonna do. Um, one other thing, which is, I noticed that I take Adderall sometimes, <laughs> not a lot, and yo, man, like, that shit fucks me up sometimes. You know, like, my, I gotta, I've been getting, my vision has been blurry, um, my eyesight, my eyes hurt. My neck hurts, stiff, you know, I don't like it at all. And sometimes I associate pain with studying, with like, you know, focusing. So, one of the things that I learned with Tony Rob is, is asking questions. Because before I used to say, damn, I gotta do this. From now on, I'm gonna ask, how can I make doing this a lot easier? And just continually ask that question, how can I, how can I, make how can I make focusing a lot easier and I'm and I'm gonna start reading a book on you know um, a book on focusing and you know just apply what they say and I'm also gonna apply the um, I'm also gonna apply getting into state when I'm gonna do any work and also apply neural so social conditioning whenever I need to get motivated I need to use this, the tools that I have and not use Adderall as a crutch because I used to view this as a weakness, my inability to focus, but I could see that I could use this as something that's, that will empower me and that's something that I could use as a challenge to help me grow, you know? So, yeah, man, like, I could see myself making a lot of good changes and it's exciting, it really is exciting. And, uh, yeah, man. Tomorrow's another day. Tomorrow, I, I didn't make a plan for tomorrow, but tomorrow I'm just gonna take a day to write. That's another thing I'm gonna do. I'm gonna start writing my my articles. Writing rather than just typing, I'll start writing because I feel like when I write, I enjoy writing more. You know, it's more enjoyable. Um, I put my whole body into it, and and I feel like because when I write, I write less, but it's more straight to the point. But when I type, I feel like because I can type faster, I could write more. You know, and so I do, there's a lot of bullshit when I write. But when I, I mean, when I type, but when I write, it's just more concise and more simplistic. And that's how I want to be able to communicate. And yeah, I'm excited about this, you know. Um, so today was a good day. Today was a very good day. Today, I felt, I felt sad today. There was a point when I felt very sad. But I was able to change my state. And I was like, wow, anytime I feel sad, there's an opportunity to actually learn how to get in state, and in which that will enable me to get in state a lot faster. And that's a good thing. So I'm like learning how to um, um, change my perception to things, to how I want it. In the past, I used to do a lot of mindfulness, and I still do, but now I'm learning a new different side of things. So it's kind of like I have a very, I know of two different ways to control my brain. And the only way I was able to get that is through having challenges. You see, challenges help you grow, man. Challenges are very good for you. You know, they're very good for you. And I believe that you can do it. Look at this. Like, my room is... Okay, look. <laughs> okay, look. It was clean. <laughs> my room was clean. But this will be a lot dirtier, you know? And I always said that how my room is is a reflection of myself, you know? I, this, it was clean. I, I just dirtied it right now. But, yeah, man, I'm happy by the improvements that I'm doing. 
So this is all for today.